Hello, welcome back to Blockburg Hard Mode. This is episode 19, part 19, day 19. So in the last episode, to recap, I built myself a brand new house because I was getting a little bored of our last home. We spent a good amount of um, episodes in there, but now I made this one and um, it's a lot bigger. However, our only problem is we actually kind of just started over with this house furniture wise. So we have no furniture, we have no money, and um, we, have <laughs> we have to start a new job job today too a lot of new things for this episode too um i'm gonna be level 10 cashier soon which means i gotta switch jobs so i think i'm gonna do the stalker job not the stalker but the stalker job but anyways before that it is 11 a.m i added some very cheap lights 60 dollars so it's not like completely dark in here anymore we have some you know got some lights our goal is to make a lot of money today and furnish a little bit more yes our new mansion. I'm just gonna call it a mansion, even though it's probably not technically considered a mansion, but it's a pretty big house. It's a pretty big one-story home, in my opinion. We don't actually- I don't have a kitchen, um, so I have to resort to pizzas. I got $27. This is indeed hard mode. Okay, I got my slice of pizza. My moods are, you know, they're okay. Now I go here and do my last shift. Wow, that's a lot of bag. My last shift as a cashier until I get every single job to level 10. That's kind of like the rule. Let's just do this. I'm just going to show this my last time. <laughs> oh, I'm going to cry. And that's that. $74. Okay, cool. We have 95 now. So let's start the stalker job. Yes. Let's see. This one should be really easy. This one should be pretty easy. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay, wait. This is this is going to be fine. This, we'll be fine. Wait, just pick the crates next. Which one? Oh, the beans. There you go. Okay, this one's not that bad. Just, you know, pick up crates and refill. Oh, this is so satisfying too, actually. Seeing things from empty to filled up. Okay, I will see you guys when um, this shift ends, I guess. We don't want to watch the whole thing. All right, so I'm done with my first day here as a restocker at BFF Supermarkets. Yes, we made $1,014 in seven minutes. And we are level four already. I feel like that job is going to be like very quick to get to level 10. So that is awesome. Okay, and our moods are pretty decent too after coming out of there. So I actually really like that job. I don't know why. I just, it gets you moving around and like looking for things to stock up on. Like it's just satisfying that is very nice i'm gonna head over to the gym no i'm not going to the gym no <laughs> you thought you thought i was going to the gym no 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 going straight home and see what else we can purchase for our house i might just speed up a few of these days for you guys so that way you know we can just kind of speed things up for these videos let's go into build mode and see what we can get kind of want to get my plant stuff back so maybe i'll buy the we did unlock a few more um gardening things which is really nice look at that we have so many options now just these few little things left to get i think our goal is to get the interior more furnished and established then we can do the landscaping last because we don't need a landscaping yet okay so my living room actually i'm gonna just color my bed a little different start off with like something very small okay Maybe I'll put like a carpet or something in here. Why am I not just focusing on the kitchen? Okay, let's get ourselves a fridge. Put that there. Uh, let's get some cheap counters. And then I think that will actually solve our... Oh my gosh. Did you see that? It's like this weird glitch again. If I put it against the wall, it flipped. Apparently I need advanced placement, but um, well, I can't do that. This is hard mode. And we need a few cheap counters. We'll have to upgrade these later. Okay, and then I'll get another... Actually, how much is an oven? Oven's 300. I could just buy that. Okay, let's do that too. So we can make food. Okay, you know what? And then since we have a little bit of money, I'm just gonna change the top of this counter to make it look a bit more expensive than it is. Cool, our kitchen is coming together. Back together it is. All right, I got... Wow, that's crazy how much we need to furnish our house it's kind of wild you know for now i'm gonna just put this picnic table inside because then i can have somewhere to sit down and eat it's a little um janky but that's okay no problem <laughs> i'm just gonna put it there it's okay like i don't want them being useless i'm just gonna use it you know i'm just gonna get my daily honey jar i don't know what skill to get up today i could go for athletic um at home i could also mm, what else is music get no music slow that is fun. i think for the next couple of days i'm just going to sleep and then just get a lot of money and we can do like all of the furnishing like in one session so that's what i'm gonna do wake up get my moods up and then rinse and repeat you i'll probably just speed it up but yeah i'm gonna do that i have a visitor apparently let's see hi i should have just said hi through the door why i, I got an open glass door are you peter brett no i'm a fan <laughs> oh <laughs> she's so depressed She's so depressed. Okay, bye. See ya. <laughs> I feel bad for her. 
I'm so sorry, Fuzzy. I'm so sorry. If you're watching this video, I am so sorry. Oh, she didn't even question it. She was like, oh, okay, bye. And so my days began to blend together as I only took care of my moods, sat on my floor watching the TV because I had no furniture. I had no couch. Eating some leftover salad from the fridge and even making more of that later. Commuting to work because, yes, I can't teleport. Getting promoted plenty of times and just kind of just grinding and um, working my life away for barely any money ever, you know. Working my life away because that's what my life has come to in this, this series. And on this day, I made $2,358, the second day. Then I came back home and worked out a little bit because I didn't want to waste my day. I wanted to be productive. And I later realized I needed my nutrition bars to make the most out of this skilling. So we're not wasting time. The next day after, the third day is $3,077. And yeah, great. I can't believe it, guys. It is day... When did I start? Start days on the Monday. Day three or day four? I've lost count. But this is my final shift here at soccer. I can't believe I finished one whole, like one whole job in one episode. Cashier and stalker done at BFF Supermarket. We're done with that building. We're done with Blocky Burgers. Let me get some food. I deserve some food. We're gonna get a pizza slice from Pizza Planet. But I've just been working my life away just so I can move into this new house that I built. It's kind of insanity. And I didn't even make that much. I only have 7k. And that's not that much. It's a decent amount for someone like me where I don't have game passes at all. Still, that's like nothing on my main account. I, I deliver pizzas for 3k. I make like 100k within 30 minutes or less on the main account so working all like pretty much an hour just to get level 10 and i only make 7k that's that's crazy but anyway i'm taking this play back home but we have let's say one two three four five more jobs to do before i can do delivery person without doing traffic laws um i don't have to do traffic laws anymore if i get every other job to level 10 so i can't wait for that I can't wait. Oh yeah, also in the meantime, I've been getting my athletic skill up to 80% now. I'll get that up. Let's go into build mode and just start furnishing our house. Let's move in. I'm technically already moved in, but moving some more furniture. So let me finish my kitchen, actually. Let me just, I'm just gonna finish my, why is it having a tough time? Where did you go? What? Well, that's as good as I'll, that will get. Okay, let's get ourselves another counter. Can I please, please, please move this here? I'm gonna cry. This is why I hate. Is that dumb? That is so silly. Where else do I set this up? Okay, let's move our picnic table back outside. I'm gonna leave the watermelon out there. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna have an island. I think we've had an island before, so I'm gonna make my own little island instead. I'm just gonna... I hate this game sometimes. Okay, that's as close as that gets. Okay, that's not that bad. That's not the worst thing ever oh this is still so bad that's terrible okay i'm gonna have just some simplicity stools for my island chairs i'm gonna have three of those and then let's get some appliances i'll just have like oh there we go wait, wait, wait. we need like cabinets and stuff i want to finish my kitchen cabinets i'm gonna get the cheapest ones i can afford why, why is it doing this why why what we need something here like why can't i put something right there to like just finish that off this game, this game, that's making me really mad. Like the way my kitchen would feel more complete if I were to add a counter there, but I can't. Why is life like this? What if we did that? What if we did that? What if we did this? Would I be mad at it? I'm not sure. I don't think I would. Let me just put lights everywhere because our house needs some lighting. Oh my gosh, that's that's a lot of money already. That's already like 1,000 down the drain. I don't want to change up my floor colors and everything, you know? Like, what if we have linen flooring for one? I don't usually have linen flooring, um, but I, I will. Okay, cool. Oh my gosh. Wow, that's beginning to look a little bit more interesting. Okay, let's work on my living room next. This is also another room that I need. We're just going to buy these simple sofas. And I'm going to move the TV. Or should I move it the other way? Let's put it here, actually. And yeah, some light switches, too. Cheap ones. It switches every single room in my house. In here, get one in here. I got a food pantry room as well. I think I'm just gonna put a bunch of bookshelves in here. Maybe these like cheap ones. I don't think a pantry room is in priority at the moment. We'll wait on that. Okay, this was gonna be a dining room. I almost forgot about what this was going to be, but that's supposed to be a dining room right here. I think I can get like a pretty big table 
for cheap this a hundred dollar dining table and i'm actually gonna open up this this room it's gonna be like we'll just make this one very open this is my dining room no, well, I'm going to leave it brown. I think I put like really cheap chairs surrounding all of this. So we have, you know, a little dining area sorted out. Maybe I'll put like a little table runner as well. Like a, a cheap one. <laughs> Let me finish my living room. I didn't finish my living room. Okay, let's get a coffee table. <laughs> I can't believe I moved. I just want things to look a little bit more expensive than they are by just texturing them. Have this thing here. We'll get ourselves a, a remote. Then I'm thinking bookshelves um, on both sides. So we have like some reading. It's looking a little bit better. Let's get ourselves a shelf above that. And then I do need to color all my rooms. I just, I'm just trying to get like all the stuff that I need first. My scale up room. I think we can just get a carpet in here. Better than nothing. Maybe I can move like my punching bag like in the center here. Maybe we need a couch or something. You never know. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna add a couch in there. That's my laundry room. It's a little sad in there too. I don't know. I feel like I just need a carpet in like a lot of space. Um, I guess the next area I want to work on is the entrance area. The entrance. Uh, maybe like a little rustic bench here. So you can like sit down. Okay. Remind me to never like move things up against the wall. I just don't. Just don't let me do that. Get a shelf here. Move the coat rack underneath that. Get a little spring one. And then maybe get like an umbrella stand. Maybe a hat stand. I'm just going to color my house this color. I've decided I'm just going to make every room this color just for now. You know what? I deserve a nice rustic dresser. Wow, that's a pretty good up upgrade, right? I deserve it. I worked all this time. I need a dresser there. Let's get a, uh, I'm just gonna get a long metal bench. Uh, yeah, let's just put a bench there. If I want to sit down, look this way for some reason. Let's just get our bathroom essentials next. Get some toilet paper. Add some wall trims. Is there anything else I could add to my- Add some wall trims. You know, let's, let's start adding in some detailing. It's gonna cost a lot because especially if my walls are long. Uh, let's add some wall trims. Okay, we're broke again. <laughs> we're broke again. I'm gonna leave like at least- $300 so I could pay the bills. I don't know how much my bills are. I think they're gonna be like 400 now But let's save a bit of money for some bills. So let's go and look around, you know, let's take a gander Let's take a look. Okay, cool. The foyer is a little bit improved. Yeah, slightly improved I have lights everywhere now and then this is my uh, skill up room. This is my skill up room I actually have to get my athletic skill up to level 5. We'll do that later. But let's tour I should add some blinds so people can't spy on me. Here's my bedroom <gasps> Actually, though, my bedroom is getting a little bit more furnished. It's feeling a bit more full. My bathroom is colored, textured now. That's great. Here. My living room is like, it feels like a living room now. I'm not sitting on my floor watching TV. That's nice. And we can read some books, get our, our intelligence up that way. We have my dining room now, which is now opened up. I got to fix my room ceiling. Yeah, we have a dining room. Then my kitchen! My kitchen's probably my biggest upgrade, I think. We actually have a functioning kitchen now. It looks really, really bad because no advanced placement. Kitchens are my nightmare when it comes to No Game Pass, as you can clearly see. But I may do with what, you know, what was possible. I tried to make it a little island, a little curve there. So, there's that. I don't know what I'm gonna do in this little area. Maybe, maybe turn this into a bathroom or something. Maybe this could be a bathroom and this could be like some open pantry. I don't know. There's still a lot of decisions to make. And then, of course, my laundry room is just... <sighs> whatever. Whatever. The... Whatever. It's fine. I didn't even notice that. My basket's going through the wall. Okay, and that is my current upgrades with my house. A uh, lot of progress today. We got a full... We got a literally a job position max to level 10. Episode, we can do another new job. I think I might... I might go into mining job. Let me know what, I, what job I should do next. But I'm gonna go ahead and get my athletic skill up. And boom, level five in the athletic skill. I have accomplished that. Let's see our rewards. We got an acai bowl, which I already had from the beginning, so that was useless. And but I do have increased stamina, so I can run around a little bit longer. Look at that. I'm so mad. I almost forget that we have sprinting sometimes, and I should start using that more. But that will wrap up today's episode. If you guys enjoyed it, you found it interesting, inspiring, make sure to give a big old thumbs up and make sure to subscribe in too because it's completely free. Which job should I start off with for the next episode? Let's just, and I'll talk to you all in the next video. Goodbye. I'm going to title this video, Working My Life Away to Move Into My New House, because that's what I'm doing. I have to work my life away just to have furniture again. Thank you.